We're here with South Carolina head coach Boo Major. The Gamecocks win the 2014 SEC Equestrian Championship. Coach, a crazy day today, a wild event. Just talk about how proud you are of your team. Well, I'm certainly really proud of our team. I mean, I think there were some um, scoring issues, and to begin with, we thought we had lost, and, you know, certainly we were extremely disappointed, but the girls handled it extremely well. We knew we had another competition where we had to help get that going, and the girls just went right back out and did, and then to turn around and find out that we did, in fact, win was, you know, really fantastic news and a lot of fun to be able to tell the girls that they actually won. Your Hunt Seat team, big performance today for them against a very tough Georgia squad. They won 6-4, to four, a pair of 3-2 to two decisions on the flat and over fences. When you go against a Georgia team that is great as they are in Hunt Seat, talk about how big those six points were. Well, the, the six points were huge. I mean, I think, and the, the point variation was huge. Um, because, uh, you know, when you throw in some um, equivalency scores and things like that in Western and, and the fact that we didn't win overall in Western um, meant that we really needed to get it done down there in the hunt seat ring. So they, they, they were fantastic. We had a, several clutch um, rods, uh, you know, thinking of Adele Norton, uh, she was the last one to go. And if she won, we would have been three to two. And if she lost, we would have been two to three. So she just went in there with all the confidence in the world and came out on top. Back-to-back -back SEC champions, the first University of South Carolina team to win back-to-back -back SEC champions in the SEC air. Just talk about that moment, you know, occasion for your team and what that means to you. Well, it, it's been obviously fantastic. I mean, it's certainly great for our program. It's great for um, the, our girls. Uh, they've worked hard. And, you know, last year, I think we went in, you know, hoping we were going to win. We were determined to win, and then we ended up winning. This one, we came in and really w came at it with a different approach of that, you know, we're just going to handle one thing at a time, and um, everybody responded. Our captains have been great to keep everybody level-headed, and um, uh, uh, we knew we had to ride really well to beat a very good Georgia team, and um, it, it's just a great feeling for our girls to have gone out there and given it everything they had. And we'll ask you about Katherine Schmidt, another great day for her. She now enters Nationals uh, with a 25-2-1 and one record, named to the All-Championship team for the second year in a row. When you look at what she's done for you, not only this year, last year, all three of her years for you, just talk about what she's meant to this program's success. Well, she's been fantastic. Fantastic. I mean, you, you you can't you can't say a bad thing about her because it's not just the way she competes, but it's the way she handles herself, her, her maturity, the way she handles her, or talks with her teammates, um, the way she helps everyone. Uh, she's just a great person altogether, and so it it's very rewarding for me, and I'm sure her and her parents, you know, to see all of her hard work pay, paying off because um, I can't think of anybody that deserves the accolades as much as she does. Coach, thank you for joining us. Uh, good luck out at Nationals. Thanks, Corey.